Hi guys, and welcome to another video. Today's video will be a full face of drugstore. I got some new products, some new shades. I wanted to give it a try to see if I picked up the right items this time. So if you want to see how I got this look, the products I used, and all of that, make sure you keep on watching and don't forget. Bye guys. Hi guys, we are back with a drugstore video today. Getting ready for work. I got my bag full of Yes, it's a Christmas bag. I have my drugstore stuff in here, so that way I won't be rushing out the door as always. <laughs> so up first, I'm going to take a primer. And today I decided to use this NYX Marshmallow Primer. I've had it for quite some time. I can never really get into it. it was just It's just something about it that doesn't do something for me, but I'm going to give it a try out today again. I'm like, I love most of Nick's products, so why I can't get into this, I do not know. And it smells amazing. <laughs> it, it makes my skin look really plump and moisturized. as you can see but i think i'm going to pair it today because i've never tried it along with a little bit of my cookies and dream just to see if this helps at the end of the day cookies and dream can fix anything We good and moisturized. Let me get my blur. It feels kind of slippery. And you would think that it wouldn't stick to my smile lines, but it does. I'm gonna go underneath my eye. Just in case I got some bags. I'm staying up all night watching crazy TV shows. <laughs> For a foundation today, I finally received from Ulta the NYX Blur. You all know I already have a video on my channel. I'm gonna link it right now. When I'm editing this video, I'm gonna remember to link it so that you can check out that video if you have not already. But those shades that I picked up originally didn't really work for me. So I went back and I got shade 19. And it's 19 Deep Golden. So we're gonna see today if this is a much better. If it, you know, if it's a little darker, because the only problem with the other shades, I love the way it looked, the way it felt, the way it applied, the way it wore throughout the day. I loved everything about it, but I really had to make that foundation work as far as with my bronzer, my concealer, my powders to deepen it up. But today, I should set the plastic off. We're gonna see if this works, if this shade works, because I already know I love the foundation. This is $14. I told y'all drugstores are getting on the pricier side, so I'm really skeptical now about saying something is drugstore. Now it's just a makeup because all of it tends to be the same, you know, the same amount. I'm gonna put a little dots on the back of my hand. So far, this color is deep enough. It's looking deep enough, right? So let's go. Yeah, it's deep enough. It's way deeper than the other one. Although once I blend the other one out, it seemed like, you know, it could suit me. Like I could get away with it. 
but what if I get like really really tan you know spray my face and my shop miss a f4 brush I'm still gonna go come back I'm going to work today is a work day and then I'm still gonna come back because I want you all to see how this shade matched me if it oxidized how did it look you know throughout the day so I still want to come back for that how y'all think this shade is You only need a little bit. It's matte. This is a matte one, okay? <laughs> it's a matte one. <laughs> I, I'm going to take a little dot on my dot down there. I found some a skin protein that is helping me get rid of this dark area. So once I see if it really works, I'll let you know. Just in case you go through the same thing I go through sometimes. Take my damp car beauty sponge and spin out. For concealer, I'm going to use the Bear With Me Concealer, and I don't know which one. I have it in Sand and Deep Golden. I think Deep Golden is my skin tone, so let me do Sand. Sand is more neutral than I prefer. So, this is Sand. And then I got the Elf in Deep Chestnut. So we'll end up mixing them, I think. They might be the same shade. I think this Bear With Me is kind of, concealer is kind of luminous. It's got a little shine to it. Where you know the elf is like a really really matte. And let's blend. Another key ingredient I look for when purchasing foundations and where you know trying to get a feel of foundations is if they apply without me tugging on my skin or having to like really really get in and blend it out if it blends smoothly without me having a on my face you know so that's another key ingredient I look for when purchasing foundations that matters and look at how light it my thread beauty in 210 
one though. use the same elf concealer to prime my lids with today i need to do a quick eye look very quick i probably got like 30 minutes to get out the door <laughs> me and my christmas bag I'm gonna take my ColourPop Matte About Hue Palette in the shade Bop. It's a purple shade right there. Put that all over my lid. Take a small elf blending brush to blend out the edges into my crease because it's the only color I'm using. <laughs> when I say quick look, that's what I meant, like real quick. I picked up from Ulta this LA Glitter, LA Girl Glitter Holic Glitter Topper. I'm gonna try that today. It says just apply with your fingertips. It was on sale, of course. Let's see. Hopefully, it's not hard. It's hard. But pretty. Hmm. I'll get as close in my inner corner as my nails will let me. <laughs> That's it. We done with the eyes. Let me throw on some liner. Be right back. Guys, y'all almost forgot to let me um, sit underneath my eye. We'll head in the concealer again. Make sure it has increased. And use my black opal around the clay girl to set it. Looks like something missing. My Juvia's Place Bronzer Dual in Dark. I'll take the deepest one out of this 
to bronze with today. Like I got powder everywhere, as you can see. My Maybelline Superstay Original 355. Let's just powder off. I'm going to take the purple shade, smoke out my lower lash line. Why I can't ever find a mirror? I'm gonna take fun, fun, fun. It's a dark shade at the bottom of the palette. I'll put it up in a minute. The lip bar, straight living to line my lips with. Nothing too dark. Okay, don't kill me. <laughs> this is Lime Prime, but I got it from TJ Maxx for like $3.99. It's a nude shade. That's the only one I see in front of me. along with my butter gloss and fortune cookie. And I know I just saw it yesterday. There it is. I put the lime crown down because that just gives me an extra layer of lipstick. It makes it a little bit harder to rub off or it lasts a little bit longer. Okay guys, this is the completed look using the NYX Bear With Me Primer, I mean primer, foundation in the shade 19 and this is how my face is looking. I'm gonna wear it throughout my work day, come back, still show you all how it looks. Hopefully it doesn't oxidize or get any darker, but right now I feel like this is the perfect shade. I'm in love with this eyeshadow topper from Ellie Girl. It was only like $2 at Ulta too, so you know I'm obsessed, so I'll probably pick up some more only because now I'm obsessed. So yeah, I'll see you guys in a few but this is how the face is looking nice 
soft matte. It's like a soft matte. I wouldn't, yeah, it's not real tight. It's a soft matte. And yeah, I'll see you in a minute. Bye, guys. Okay, guys, after a little over 10 hours worth of wear, I am back. This is how my face is looking without any blotting or anything. I must say it's looking really, really nice. Y'all know the drill. Let me get my powder brush. And no powder. Just blot what I have away. This foundation with my mostly oily though, like on my eyebrows. Not necessarily even in my T-zone. I'm surprised with the marshmallow primer. You know, this morning I said that I really didn't care for it. But mixed with my e.l.f. Cookies and Dream, anything is possible. Elf Cookies and Dream makes anything work. I think this looks amazing on my skin. 10 hours? Come on now. You got to give it up for the drugstore. It's okay to have I-N, I-N, <laughs> I'm tired, high-end items. But drugstore, you got to give credit where credit is due because that foundation is looking real good. For fourteen dollars, what y'all think? Shade nineteen. Don't forget shade nineteen and free shade twins. Then you know I'm delu. Uh, I'm delusional. I'm tired and I'm hungry. Like going back to work after holidays. It's like the worst. <laughs> I'm grateful. I thank the Lord for a job, but it's just about wore me out today. I am tired so if you enjoyed today's video please make sure you like comment and subscribe guys and i'm gonna see y'all in the next one until then this is nyx blur shade 19 10 hours worth of wear and this is how we look at bye guys